Yo lads, how's it going and welcome back to another video here today. Today is a bit of a different one. Today I'm going to show you how to record your iOS screen. It is a bit of a different video and a lot of people are asking me how I record on iOS. So my last video's gameplay was really laggy so I've gone and looked for a new screen recorder and I've gone and found one that works. No timestamps that limit you to two minutes of recording, no lag or anything like that. And I'm going to show you guys it here today. If it does help you out, please do share with your friends that are looking for a screen recorder. It means a lot. You don't need to subscribe if you are new because this is a really different video to what I normally do. But if it does help you out, please do leave a like. It'd be much appreciated. So once you've got your device app ready, you want to go over to Safari. There will be a link in the description to this web page. I want you to go on this and press install app valley. This will pop up. Just press install again and it will come and download onto your home screen. So once downloaded, if I press on this, it will not work straight away. So what I wanna do is go over to settings, into general, scroll to the bottom to profile and device management, and I wanna click on this one here that says Beijing, etc. So you wanna press trust and trust again, and then I'm just gonna open it here. So open it up, and this is what it will look like. You wanna go over to library on the bottom, press apps and then browse, and then around the middle, there should be air shell. You need to click on this air shell and then press get here in the top corner. Press install and there it is on the bottom of my screen. I want to click on this and it'll open up. So you want to press don't allow and then agree to the terms and conditions and this will what will pop up. This is the iOS screen recorder that does work. Air shell didn't work but because of this new app valley thing it does now work. So I'm going to go over to record press next step allow it to use the microphone and it will come up with this you want to swipe up the control panel airplay mirroring and then click on the first thing that comes up it should say air shout and then whatever now my screen is recording I will put an overlay of it and then I want to press the home button and I'll go over to FIFA mobile wherever it is hiding so open up FIFA and it will work without lagging once we've decided your recording is finished just press press stop then it'll take you back to this page and this is where your recording will be hiding if I play this now though if I skip through you will see that it will become very glitchy and not nice to look at so there's something wrong with the encoding so I'm gonna close that and then I want to tap on it and then save to camera roll so I want you to go over to the app store and install this just search up video joiner and trimmer and this will come up I, want, I recommend this one considering it does not have adverts or anything in it so once you open it up you want to press the add button video and then import the video of your choice this is the one that i've just recorded so once i've done that i just want to render it straight away without doing anything to it this will stop all the glitches that show up on the screen and i'll show you once it is finished rendering so now i have two files here at the bottom if i click on this one which was the original recording and scroll through it it will become all glitchy as you can see Whereas if I go over to this one and press play, the recording no longer becomes glitchy and it works as perfectly as showed before. So that is how to record your iOS screen. If this video did help you out, then please do smash the like button. It would help you out a lot more than you would think. And other than that, guys, I will catch you in my next video. Stay sick, stay epic, and peace.